All right, guys, it's Monday um, for lunch. I decided to do Jimmy John's um, scrimmage sandwich. I just got some bottled water, something lighter, not a, not chips. I want to eat a little bit lighter today. Um, but I did ask for extra mayonnaise. I know oil, vinegar, I think, oregano. I was going to get cheese, but it was dollar extra. And I was like, you know, I don't know if I need cheese. It's pretty good without cheese, so I'm going to try it out. They didn't cut it. Interesting. Okay. Um, I was the bread is so good at Jimmy John's, but um, it's like lettuce, little vinegar, tomatoes, pickles. Hmm. I thought I asked for onions, but I don't see it. Oh well, whatever. Let's try bite first, guys. Hmm. That's very good. I didn't ask for mustard because they didn't have regular mustard. I mean, they could have given me the packets of mustard. I'm not really big on the Dijon mustard. Maybe I should have tried their own. They have this other mustard that they have that's special, that are mustard or something. Maybe I should have tried that. One time I tried the Dijon mustard, I didn't really like it. But um, it was just extra mayonnaise, but no mustard. You know, mustard gives that little tame, but this is kind of healthy because it has no cheese. <laughs> mm. Oh, there is onion on here. Okay. That's good. What's good about Jimmy John's is they were with, the guy was making it as I was ordering it. So like by the time I paid, it was already ready. And there was nobody in there. So that was pretty cool. Mm. So today's Monday. Yesterday was Sunday and I filmed a Del Taco video and I forgot to talk about my dream. That's why I wanted to do another mukbang video. And I realized all my videos that I post and all my social media, whatever, my favorite videos to post are mukbang videos. I really want to post. For me, I enjoy mukbang videos, just regular videos. But anyways, I want to talk about my dream I had. Um, I've been thinking about an apartment. I really want one. And my back's been hurting me. And I realized... When I get up from the bed, my back's worse. So I'm pretty sure it's the bed. I think it's the bed. I'm not really sure. It might be the mattress. It's it's not really firm. But I really I still want to manifest an apartment because I only have a I have a very 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 small studio. It's just kitchen, little hallway, little bathroom. The bedroom section is like the bed, and the, I have a TV. That's all I can put. Now some studio apartments you can they you can have a bed and a couch. This is a setup where it's just there's no way there's no room. The only way I could take it, put the couch is if I got rid of the table and my dip my you know my table in the kitchen, but this would seem kind of weird and I don't know if I want that, you know. I don't I wouldn't even have a table, so so last week I started manifest I was trying to manifest an apartment. I was trying to like, you know, write down what I want and say affirmations. I have an apartment, you know, you know, a good space that's reasonable price, you know. I could have a couch. And um, so yeah, I started I started at the beginning process of trying to manifest an apartment. And I'm gonna give you a few more bites before I tell you. Let me tell you the dream I had actually. <laughs> so yeah, um, the dream was um, I walked into this apartment, I think it was my nephew. And, um, I remember the number was eight, which eight in Chinese astrology is good, good luck. I used to have a bumper sticker with 888. I spent like 20 bucks on this bumper sticker because I put it back in my car. And eight is a good symbol. This, in Chinese astrology, it's like 
good luck. And, you know, and I think four is a bad number for Chinese attraction. So they were like saying, um, don't get an apartment with number four because it's kind of like bad luck for the house. But um, I just remember that the um, apartment number was eight. I was like, that was really interesting. So it's kind of a vivid dream. It was like really vivid. So it's really, so I walk in, right? And there is a refrigerator and in the refrigerator is just jam packed with food. Mostly candy, like Snickers, MMM, Almond Joy. It was just like crazy amount of candy bars. Like I, so it was like this, so this person was like before me, they didn't clean up the refrigerator. So that's kind of weird. It was like, why wouldn't they not clean the refrigerator? I was kind of, well, that's really weird. And then, um, I remember I was showing my nephew the, my, my bedroom area, you know, and I was like saying it's really, really big. I think I could do a lot of filming in my bedroom area if I wanted to. And the living room was pretty big. Not vivid up in the living room that much, but um, there was a garage. But it's like they were doing maintenance on the, I had my own garage or something. But they were doing maintenance on the garage. It was kind of like they heard there was workers there. So it was like... And then across from the apartment, there is this um, employee that I used to work with at Walmart. And it was like weird. I was like, she was right across from me. It was, was kind of weird. But so back to my apartment, I was just like, it's just so weird. Like, it's not ready. Like, why would they like give it to me? If the apartment's not ready yet. And for me, that was a sign that kind of, that dream. So that dream for me, it felt like. I already started manifesting my apartment, but it's not ready yet, but it's coming. <laughs> I don't know. That's what, that's what the dream felt like to me. Like it's, it's not, it's not ready yet, but it's coming, it's coming, it's coming, <laughs> but it's like already manifest, starting to manifest. That's kind of cool. So I've been looking at apartments lately. There's a lot more in my area than there was a month or two months ago. Um, they're going between... 15 to 1600 1500 might be in the bad area um are not super close to you know my work so i'm probably it's, it's gonna be like 200 dollars extra than my apartment right now originally around around 200 unless i get some in-law units are actually really good though so so i'm trying to think about like you know, but some people, some like I saw one that I ever liked, but they want three times the amount of rent. So, you know, I don't work at Walmart anymore, so I don't know how I'm gonna improve how much money I made unless I, I don't know, it's just gonna be really weird. So, um, I don't know, I, I thought that dream was really cool. I wanted just to share that with you guys. I know a lot of people like the law of attraction. You guys can give me your thoughts on the dream. I, for me, I think it's like. I had the ha apartment, but it's not ready yet. It's just, it's just, they're working on it. <laughs> For me, that's what. <laughs> I think this sandwich needs mustard. So maybe I will get mustard next time. Maybe I will get mustard next time. It just needs some kind of like, I don't know, maybe mustard. <laughs> Mm. You know, it also needs some of that mild peppers. I forgot what they're called. Subway, I think, has better produce, but I think the bread is better here at Jimmy John's. This is good, though. Mm. So last Saturday I filmed like a bunch of free reviews. I did an ASMR video as well. So if you guys don't know, I have an ASMR channel, or if you're new to this channel, hopefully by the time you see this, I will have uploaded my video. It's like a roleplay video. 
I'm like the Walmart manager and I'm giving somebody an interview. So I think it's kind of cool. I haven't uploaded it. I haven't edited it out or nothing yet. So hopefully by the time you see this video, that will be out. I have so many videos I, I like, but I don't have a lot of time to upload them. I don't have a lot of time to edit them because I come home. I'm so tired from work. So, um, but I'm hoping to get a good schedule going on. You know, and then my nephews are seeing me more. I'm seeing more family more since going to Walmart. So it's like I don't have a lot of time to edit. It's kind of hard. I really like filming mukbang videos. I'm gonna do maybe I'll do more mukbang videos. The qual the lighting isn't very good in here. I don't know why. <laughs> But um, it's kind of like over over cloudy. It's kind of cloudy right now, so it's not the best lighting. Also, if you're new, I have another channel called Care Bear, um, where I do like food reviews. I do. That channel is more like it's a little bit different than this channel. It's like it's like live mukbang. If you like lives, check out my other channel called Care Bear. Where I do live mukbang videos sometimes. Um, I do food reviews. I do what's for dinner, cooking videos. I tell you guys what to eat for for a week for dinner. You know, for one person, I live alone, so check that out. Um, I'll leave the link in my Care Bear channel in the description down below. You guys can check it out if you want. As for extra mayonnaise, look like it's all on the bottom, like at the very end. I mean, how do you guys feel about shredded lettuce on sandwiches? I think I like regular lettuce better. I'm not sure, but but yeah, they put shredded lettuce on on this sandwich. It's quite messy though. <laughs> but very good. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.